And so my beloved warriors of peace, let me bring this message home to your hearts. When they push against your peace and push their will, stand like the ancient pyramids, timeless and unmoved. Let their attempts to disturb you become testimonies to your tranquility. Remember this always, you are not what happens to you. You are how you choose to respond. When chaos circles like hungry wolves, be the moon that continues to shine unbothered by the howling below. I tell you now, with all the wisdom that years have granted me, your peace is not negotiable. Your serenity is not for sale. Your calm is not up for debate. Let them bring their storms while you remain the eye of the hurricane, still centered, sovereign. For in the end, dear hearts, this is your superpower, this ability to remain unmoved by the small mindedness of others, this capacity to stay centered when the world spins wild. Let your unbothered nature become your signature, your serenity become your statement. And when they ask how you do it, and as they will, Tell them you learn to be like the sky, vast enough to contain all weather without being changed by any of it. Tell them you learn to be like the ocean, deep enough to absorb all disturbances while maintaining your own rhythm. So go forth now, my precious ones, wearing your peace like a crown, carrying your calm like a torch. Let them see what true power looks like, not in the ability to create chaos, but in the choice to remain unbothered by it. For you are not just surviving, you are thriving. You are not just existing, you are excelling. If you are not just standing, you are soaring. And in your unshakable peace, you become living proof that the greatest power lies not in the ability to disturb others, but in the choice to remain undisturbed. This is your legacy, this is your life, this is your truth. Stand in it, live it, be it. For in your unbothered grace, you become a lighthouse for others, showing them what's possible when you choose peace over perturbation, serenity over stress, calm over chaos. And remember, always remember, you are not what others say about you. You are not what others think about you. You are not what others wish you to be. You are your own magnificent self, standing tall in your truth, unbothered by the winds of opinion, unmoved by the storms of judgment. This is your power. This is your peace. This is your truth. Own it, live it, be it. For in your unbothered existence, you become a living testament to the power of choosing peace over drama, grace over grudges, and serenity over strife. And that, my beloved warriors, is this their ultimate victory, not in conquering others, but in remaining unconquered by their attempts to disturb your peace. Stand tall in this truth and let your unbothered nature become your greatest strength, your lasting legacy, your eternal peace. Listen closely, my precious ones, for what I'm about to share with you isn't just about money. It's about the essence of abundance itself. When I say act like a millionaire, I'm not talking about flashing wealth or throwing dollars to the wind. No, no, my dear hearts, I'm talking about something far more profound. Think about this. Have you ever noticed how true wealth walks quietly? How real abundance doesn't need to announce itself? That's the first secret I want you to understand. A millionaire mindset isn't about showing what you have. It's about knowing who you are. I've seen poverty children. Oh yes, I've lived it. But even in those days when my pockets were empty, I carried myself like I owned the universe. Because dignity, you see, doesn't have a price tag. Excellence doesn't check your bank balance before showing up. When you walk into a room, any room, carry yourself like you own the building, not with arrogance, mind you, but with that quiet certainty that comes from knowing your worth isn't measured in dollars and cents. It's measured in the currency of your character. You see, real millionaires understand something that others miss. They know that wealth is first a state of mind before it becomes a state of being. They don't wait to become rich to act rich in spirit. They act abundant right where they are with what they have. Think about the oak tree, my darlings. Does it wait until summer to believe in its potential? Does it doubt its worth in winter? No, it contains the fullness of its magnificence in every season, in every some moment. And let me tell you something about carrying yourself with millionaire energy. It's not about the clothes you wear, though you should always wear your dignity like the finest silk. It's about how you treat yourself and others, how you move through this world as if abundance is your birthright. When you enter a restaurant, don't scan the right side of the menu where the prices are. Look at what feeds your soul, what nourishes your spirit. A true millionaire mindset isn't about spending carelessly, it's about knowing you deserve the best and being willing to work for it. I've seen people with millions act poor in spirit, and I've seen those with pennies carry themselves like royalty. You see, wealth isn't just about what's in your wallet, it's about what's in your heart, what's in your mind, what's in your spirit. Think about time. A millionaire treats time like the precious commodity it is. 
They don't waste it on petty concerns or small thinking. They invest it, they respect it, they understand that time is the one currency we all have in equal measure. When you speak, speak with the confidence of someone who knows their words have value. Don't scatter your thoughts like loose change. Present them like precious gems, carefully chosen, beautifully displayed. A millionaire mindset means understanding that everything you do is an investment in yourself, in your future, in your legacy. The way you make your bed in the morning, the way you answer the phone, the way you treat the janitor, it all matters. Remember this, wealthy people don't do different things, they do things differently. They don't wait for circumstances to change to change their behavior. They change their behavior to change their circumstances. Listen now, for this is crucial. A millionaire's greatest asset isn't their money, it's their mindset. When you wake up in the morning, don't check your bank account first, check your attitude. Are you thinking in abundance or scarcity? Are you focusing on opportunities or obstacles? I've seen people chase money like it's running away from them, but true wealth, my darlings, walks beside those who walk with purpose. It's attracted to those who carry themselves with dignity, who treat every dollar as a seed that can grow into a forest. Think about how a millionaire reads. They don't just read words, they read opportunities. Every book is an investment, every conversation a potential golden thread in the tapestry of their success. Start doing that now, right where you are. When you dress yourself in the morning, dress as if success is waiting to meet you for lunch. Not with flashy labels, mind you, but with the kind of care and attention that says, I respect myself enough to present my best self to the world. You see, wealthy people understand something fundamental, that they know that how you do anything is how you do everything. They don't wait for a million dollars to start acting with precision, with purpose, with pride in their work. When you write an email, write it like a millionaire would, clear, purposeful, respectful of both your time and the recipients. When you make a promise, keep it as if your million dollar reputation depends on it, because one day it will. Remember this truth, millionaires don't look for shortcuts, they look for long-term solutions. They don't seek quick fixes, they build lasting foundations. Start thinking that way now, even if your bank account hasn't caught up with your mindset yet. Now hear this, precious ones, a millionaire's network is their net worth. But I'm not talking about collecting business cards like autumn leaves. I'm talking about how you treat every person you meet as if they might hold the key to your next opportunity. Because they might. When you speak on the phone, speak as if you're sitting in the boardroom of your own company. When you send a text message, compose it as if it might be read in a room full of investors. Excellence doesn't wait for an audience. Excellence is the audience. I've watched people waste years waiting to feel wealthy before acting wealthy. But that's like waiting to get in shape before going to the gym. The action comes first, my darlings. The feelings follow. The results come last. Think about how a millionaire makes decisions. They don't ask, can I ask for this? They ask, is this worth my investment? Start thinking that way about everything, your time, your energy, your relationships, your commitments. When you eat, eat like someone who values their health as much as their wealth. When you rest, rest like someone who knows their energy is worth millions. When you work, work like someone who understands that excellence is the minimum standard. You see, wealthy people don't just plan for tomorrow, they plan for next year, next decade, next generation. Start thinking in terms of legacy, not just lunch. Think in terms of impact, not just income. Remember this, millionaires don't compete with others, they compete with their previous selves. They don't measure their success against their neighbor's car. They measure it against their own potential. And let me tell you something about a millionaire's relationship with money, they don't worship it, they respect it. They don't serve money, they make money serve them. Start treating every dollar like an employee, it should be working for you, not the other way around. When you walk down the street, walk like someone who knows their destiny is greater than their history. When you shake hands, shake with the confidence of someone who knows their word is worth more than gold. I've seen people living in mansions, but thinking in shacks. I've seen people in modest homes dreaming palatial dreams. You see, my darlings, your address doesn't determine your mindset. Your mindset determines your future address. I think about how a millionaire approaches problems. They don't see obstacles. They see opportunities wearing work clothes. They don't see expenses. They see investments. They don't see failures. They see feedback. When you set goals, set them like a millionaire would, not based on what seems possible, but on what would be transformational. Don't ask what you can afford to dream. Ask what dreams you can't afford to ignore. You see, wealthy people understand that money is attracted to clarity, to purpose, to value creation. They don't chase money, they chase excellence and let money chase them. Start doing that now, right where you are. When you serve others, serve with the generosity of someone who knows abundance is unlimited. 
When you solve problems, solve them with the creativity of someone who knows solutions are worth millions. Listen carefully now, for this truth is precious. A millionaire's greatest investment isn't in stocks or real estate, it's in themselves. They understand that the highest return on investment comes from developing their mind, their skills, their character. When you learn something new, learn it as if that knowledge could be worth millions, because it might be. When you practice a skill, practice it as if mastery could open doors to fortunes, because it often does. I've seen people waiting for opportunities while opportunities were waiting for prepared people. You see, my darlings, success isn't just about being in the right place at the right time. It's about being the right person when the right time comes. Think about how a millionaire values relationships. They don't network, they build connections. They don't just exchange business cards, they exchange value. They don't just make contacts, they create contacts for mutual growth. When you face setbacks and face them, you will handle them like a millionaire would. Don't see losses, see lessons. Don't see endings, see beginnings. Don't see problems, see possibilities waiting to be unleashed. You see, wealthy people understand that every interaction is an opportunity, every conversation is a potential collaboration, every challenge is a chance to create value. Start approaching your life with that level of awareness. Remember this, millionaires don't just gather resources, they become resources. They don't just accumulate wealth, they create wealth. They don't just take opportunities, they create opportunities for others. Now hear this profound truth. A millionaire schedule reflects their priorities, not their precious. They don't let time happen to them, they make time work for them. Start treating your hours like $100 bills, invest them wisely. When you make plans, make them like someone who knows their future is worth millions. When you keep appointments, keep them like someone who understands that punctuality is the respect of kings. I've watched people treat time like it's infinite and money like it's scarce. But true millionaires know better. They understand that time is the one resource you can never get back, the one currency you can never earn more of. Think about how a millionaire approaches their health. They don't wait until they're sick to invest in wellness. They don't treat their body like a fast food restaurant. They treat it like a temple of wealth creation. When you speak about your dreams, speak with the certainty of someone who sees their vision as clearly as they see their reflection. Don't whisper your ambitions, declare them with the confidence of someone who knows manifestation follows declaration. You see, wealthy people understand that luxury isn't about price tags, it's about choice. The choice to spend your time as you wish, the choice to work on what inspires you, the choice to create impact rather than just income. Start viewing your current situation as temporary, but your standards as permanent. A millionaire doesn't wait for circumstances to change to raise their standards, they raise their standards to change their circumstances. And here's something vital, my precious ones, a millionaire's morning routine is determined by their alarm clock, but by their ambition. They don't wake up to work, they wake up to win. Start treating each dawn as a fresh opportunity to build your empire. When you plan your day, plan it like someone who knows their time is worth thousands per hour. When you choose your activities, choose them like someone who understands that focus is the mother of fortune. I've seen people live in paycheck to paycheck while dreaming check the true wealth builders, my darlings, they live intention to intention, purpose to purpose, vision to vision. Think about how a millionaire approaches education. They don't stop learning when school ends. They see all of life as their university. Every experience is a lecture. Every challenge is an exam. Every person is a potential professor. When you handle money, even if it's just a few dollars, handle it with the respect of someone who understands that every dollar is a seed that can grow into a forest of abundance. Don't let money slip through your fingers like water. Let it flow through your life like a river with purpose. You see, wealthy people understand that prosperity isn't just about accumulation, it's about circulation. They know that money must flow, but it must flow with intention, with purpose, with wisdom. When you face decisions, make them like someone who knows each choice is a brick in the foundation of their fortune. Don't decide based on fear or scarcity. Decide based on growth and opportunity. Listen closely now. For this wisdom is golden. A millionaire's relationships aren't measured by what they can get, but by what they can give. They understand that true networking isn't about collecting cars, it's about connecting hearts. When you enter a conversation, enter it like someone who has wisdom worth millions to share. When you listen, listen like someone who knows that the next million dollar idea might be hidden in someone else's words. I've seen people chase success like it's a butterfly, but true success, my precious ones, is attracted to those who plant gardens of value for others to bloom in. Start planting those seeds today, right where you are. 
Think about how a millionaire approaches failure. They don't see it as a stop sign, they see it as a detour. They don't see it as an ending, they see it as education. Every no is merely a not yet in disguise. When you set your goals, set them like someone who understands that dreams aren't just wishes, they're assignments from the universe. Write them down with the precision of someone drafting a million dollar contract with destiny. You see, wealthy people understand that confidence isn't about what's in your bank account, it's about what's in your mind account. They invest in their mindset first, knowing the rest will follow. Remember this, millionaires don't just have good habits, they have rich habits. They don't just make good choices, they make wealth building choices. Every decision, every action, every response is filled to the lens of abundance. And now my precious warriors of understand this truth, a millionaire's greatest asset isn't in their vault, it's in their vision. They see opportunities where others see obstacles, they see potential where others see problems. When you walk into a room, carry yourself like someone who knows their presence as value. When you speak, let your words carry the weight of someone who understands that language creates reality. I've seen people wearing designer labels but carrying discount store mindsets. Remember this, wealth isn't about what you wear, it's about what you're aware of. Start being aware of opportunities, of possibilities, of potential all around you. Think about how a millionaire approaches gratitude. They don't wait to be successful to be grateful. They're grateful their way to success. They understand that appreciation appreciates that what you focus on flourishes. When you face challenges and face them, you will, dear ones, face them like someone who knows that every problem solved is worth a fortune. Don't run from difficulties, run towards solutions. You see, wealthy people understand that their reputation is their real wealth. They guard their word like it's worth millions, because it is. They keep their promises like they're keeping precious jewels. When you think about your future, think like someone who knows success is inevitable. Not because of luck, but because of labor. Not because of chance, but because of choice. Not because of circumstances, but because of character. And now, my beloved ones, let me bring this message home to your hearts. A millionaire's legacy isn't counted in dollars and cents. It's measured in lives touched, in value created, in wisdom shared. When you lay your head down at night, rest like someone who knows they've invested their day wisely. When you rise in the morning, rise like someone who knows opportunities await their awareness. I've seen wealth come and go like ties, but true abundance, my precious ones, from who you are, not what you have. Let that truth sink deep into your spirit. Think about how a millionaire leaves a room. They leave it better than they found it. They leave people feeling richer for having met them, start creating that kind of wealth in every interaction. When you dream and dream, you must dream like someone who knows their visions are down payments on their destiny. Don't limit your imagination to your current circumstances. Let it soar beyond the boundaries of what seems possible. You see, at the end of the day, acting like a millionaire isn't about pretense, it's about presence. It's about showing up fully, living intentionally, creating value consistently. Remember this final truth. The difference between those who achieve wealth and those who don't isn't in their circumstances, it's in their choices, their habits, their beliefs. So go forth now, my warriors of abundance. Carry yourself with the dignity of someone who knows their worth isn't determined by their wallet, but by their character. Let your actions speak of abundance. Let your words create wealth. Let your presence generate prosperity. For in this journey of becoming, it's not about waiting until you have millions to act like a millionaire. It's about acting like a millionaire until the millions have no choice but to come to you. So this is your time. This is your moment. This is your destiny calling. Answer with the confidence of someone who knows that true wealth begins in the mind before it ever shows up in the bank. Stand tall in this truth, walk steady in this wisdom, and let every step you take be a step toward the abundance that is your birthright. For you are not just becoming wealthy, you are becoming the very essence of wealth itself. And that, my precious ones, is the ultimate secret of acting like a millionaire. It's not an act at all. It's simply allowing your true, abundant nature to shine through in everything you do, everything you say, everything you are. Now go forth and prosper, not just in money, but in spirit and wisdom and purpose and love. For these are the true measures of wealth the real currency of a life well lived, the authentic mark of a millionaire's mindset. And remember always, you are not becoming what you are not. You are simply revealing what you have always been, a being of infinite worth, unlimited potential, and abundant grace. Let that truth guide every step of your journey to prosperity.